Hey, it's Anthony from Semi Informatic, and today we're going to be playing some Oxygen Not Included. This is an early access game from Clay, the same people who bought you uh, Don't Starve, Shank, Mark of the Ginger. We really don't, we really, sorry, really don't like, we really like Don't Starve, so uh, we thought we'd give this one a go. Let's start a new game. In my last game, I learnt that uh, water that's on top of rocks that are cracking will cause those rocks to disintegrate and flood your base. That's what I learnt today. So let's have a look at our um, crew. Uh, I like this guy. Well, actually, he's a bit of an all-rounder, isn't he? Uh, I'm looking at their stress responses, and I don't want binge eater. Vomiter is an okay stress response because... Um, He's going to eat a lot of food, isn't he? Well, that's probably alright. Well, maybe we've got two of them who are going to eat a lot of food. Maybe we... Yeah, that's okay. Alright. So let's call this... Doomed Base. I just don't want somebody, like, hoovering up all the food. So, here we go. We're starting in this... Uh, asteroid for some reason. These guys are called duplicants. Uh, and I'm gonna make them dig. Now we've started near a lot of metal which is good. So despite the name of the game oxygen is included, uh, this stuff oxalite generates oxygen. And so what we're looking for, we're going to break into a vacuum here, which means our oxygen is going to get into a lower concentration. In fact, if we have a look here, we can see that's not breathable. It's breathable. It's kind of breathable. And I'm interested to see what happens once we break into the vacuum as the oxygen is just going to rush in. And we saw a cracked... Um, As long as we don't go in there, we'll be, we'll be fine. That guy's going to fall down. And he's going to go in there and we're all going to die. He's holding his breath. <laughs> Maybe we don't need to dig that far. Maybe we should just, you know, cancel the... And leave it until the um all right good work everyone we just need to make sure the oxygen gets in there eventually um right so the problem i now face is that i need to build a restroom for them I was going to do it over there. You don't want to be under there. That's not a good place to be. You're going to be trapped. So... It appears that we have the same problem that we used to have in Dwarf form. Well, no, no, we don't actually. <laughs> Where Dwarves can actually just get trapped. This is a storage container. We're going to store things in it. But we don't want to store... Uh... It's not here. We don't want to store polluted um, soil. But it doesn't seem to be in the list at the moment. Maybe because we don't have any. We'll have to come back and make sure that's ticked off. What I'm trying to do... ...is build all the way over here. So that they've got somewhere to poop. Because that's important. But I don't want them pooping sort of near where everything else is. You know, actually, I might cancel these last ones. Uh, 
Let's leave it at that. Let's see how they go with that. When you finish that, you can go to the toilet. That's the way this thing works. We'll go back where there is oxygen. Does that thing have oxygen in it? Well, I'll just make this complete by... We may be getting them to do too much at once here. Just so they can poop. <laughs> it's a nice pocket of unbreathable gas you've got there. I also want to set up, set up a generator, a couple of batteries, let's say three, uh, and a research station. Uh, where's it gone? Power, there we go, electrical wire. So we've got to connect all these things. It'll just get them out of working under there. And the colony requires toilets. I'm trying. Make them a little bit happier. Although the first cycle is going to be finishing soon. We're not going to have toilets on day one. foundation. Uh, alright, sure. There we go, we'll complete the foundation. Look at this guy, he's doing alright. Let's just speed them all up. I think we're gonna hit the first cycle and not have toilets, which is bad. Maybe we can just build one. Yep, no, oh, well, they're gonna have to queue up to use that one. Oh, so somebody ran on the thing, did they? So let's get some research happening. And I want to research compost so I've got something to do with the polluted dirt that the, the toilet creates. Alright, let's slot back down again. And let's have a look at our jobs. Let's look at research. So... You're not allowed to use research. And neither are new duplicates. Apparently Stinky can't use research. Sorry, so... <laughs> Stop running on the bloody thing and start researching. We are running out of food, too. Oh, actually, 18,000 kilocals, not too bad. Um, hey, what you doing? Pooping, huh? It's 
Jeez, it just seems like everything's gone into a go slow all of a sudden. Anyone gonna finish all this digging, stinky? That's what has our gas levels going. Okay, so they're not gonna be too happy when they're on the toilet because it's not really breathable oxygen down there. Ah, uh, we need something to help with that, don't we? electricity doesn't it so let's build it there well I don't think we have much in the way of algae there's some down there so we may end up tunneling through to that base and food source. Nobody's real keen on finishing all this digging that I wanted done which is annoying me. Let's um... Let's open up this area I think. We miss one. What's going on here? Insufficient resource algae. Yeah, I know we're trying to fix that. Doesn't look like we've got an awful lot of algae around, so I'm kind of hesitant to use the algae that we have just to generate oxygen. We're gonna get a new duplicate at some stage. Yeah, no, we're gonna solve this problem in a minute. Hopefully. I'm interested to see what happens when they open that pocket. I mean, it's low concentrations of oxygen, but sure, it's. I mean, it's not like we need you to run on that fucking thing. We've got power. See, let's. Can we just disable it? And just say, she's fine. You don't need to run on that thing. Stinky. Seriously, man. We've got stuff we ought to do. Alright, go load that bloody thing up. There we go, oxygen is now included. At least for a little while. A thought also occurs that we need a place to have the carbon dioxide to go. Like if we just push it around. Got a lot of copper. Hmm. 
Yeah, it's kind of working. Wow. Crystals. I don't think I've ever been into an area like this before. Although it appears cold. Oh, let's finish our... Uh, Power, let's re-enable that building. Uh, where did what's her face go? You're supposed to be researching. Or did we No, we haven't finished What are you doing? Why I should have disabled you from all other jobs, shouldn't I? Uh, there's a bit of algae up there. And it's breathable. Maybe we could break into this area next. Of course, the larger area we open up, the and you can see our oxalite is starting to decay here. The larger area we open up, the worse it's going to get for us as far as having to spend spending resources to generate breathable air. See, now that's kind of workable now, down there. This is really workable. <laughs> Probably too workable. Let's just turn you off. We'll turn you back on when... Uh, When, uh, we need you, because I don't want to be wasting power and... <laughs> Just fell asleep on top of the ladder. You'll notice that at night, um... I'm going to make sure they're sleeping in areas that have a good oxygen concentration. Alright, so what do we do once we're up here? We need to, I don't know, deal with that thing, I guess. It doesn't look, I mean, it's cold over here, but nobody's over there, right? This seems all okay. See now it's starting to creep back up. Ah! Oh, now that we've got toilets. Okay, let's set some stuff up for them to do first. They're gonna obviously disturb whatever that creature was. Let's say we do not want polluted dirt. Watch what happens when they disturb that creature, because I've never done it before, so I don't know. Oh god, he's not happy. Can both of them attack? You want to help your friend there? Apparently not. Alright, how are we going oxygen wise? Alright, it's starting to get a little bit shitty, so let's turn this back on. Does someone have to actually go and enable it? Yeah, great. Good news, the toilets work. You can toilet to your heart's content. 
How do we go with that research? Well, that's really slow. Catalina, you really need to concentrate more on research. Alright, so I think we're okay for the time being. Now we just need to figure out what we're going to do with this area up the top. I have an idea. Let's... Get rid of all of this stuff. Because that will turn itself into food, I think. Hey, uh, Catalina, what I need you to do is research. Because without that, the colony will die. It may seem unimportant now, but the things that you're researching will ensure that this colony goes into the future. Three of a cycle to our next duplicate. Oh yeah, how's our algae situation? We've pushed all of the carbon dioxide back. Now, now when this shit runs out, we're on our own as far as generating oxygen goes, which is a scary prospect. Oh look, Nails just leveled up. He got better at running, probably. Alright, let's start with some things up here. them some places to sleep. Just do I have to disable the fucking running wheel again? You guys. I need you working on this stuff. Oh no, I need to eat. Or do something. I swear, if one of you fuckers gets on that running wheel... God, why is it so hard just to build... four tiles and a bed? Yeah, I'll bet you're cold. Alright, you know what? Because Catalina's doing her job, she's getting the first bed. Then Stinky. And I want to build one more for this new guy. Oh, good. Everything happened at once. Alright, so. The new guy's ready. The science machine finished, so we've got new stuff. Ah. Uh, so now let's research. Uh, we've got a lot of that. What do I really want? Probably sanitation. Let's get started on liquid piping. So what we're going to do is I'm going to give the new guy a place just yet. Actually, maybe we will. Hey, new guy. Come help. 
Alright, don't want you. Stress response. Destructive. Don't want you. Stress response. But you can't dig. Maybe we'll just set you up to run on the wheel for the rest of your life. Alright, Mima. Sorry, Nails gets the cot first because he actually works for a living. And, well, you're kind of working, I guess, but... Let's put a nice vase up here. Increase the decor. Oh, right. We we did stuff. So, compost bin here. So that the dirt from the compost thing. So let's turn you back on. So they don't, just in case they start to, oh, it's actually not too bad down there. Maybe we won't turn you back on. Alright. Guess what, Mima? You get a bed even though you've only just shown up. Okay, well, things are looking up. Or well, things are looking, I should say. We still need food. Food would be good. So. Uh, I think that's probably a good time to leave it. This has been Anthony for Semi-Informatic. This is Oxygen Not Included. It's an early access game from Clay. People who bought You Don't Starve and Shank and Mark of the Ninja. Um, it's a lot of fun, even in early access. You should give it a go if you look interested in uh, this. Let's plant this seed. Briar seed. Um, yeah, so I'll see you next time.